Hi guys, in this video we're going to talk about colour blindness. We're firstly going to recap how we perceive colour uh, in our vision, and then we're going to look at what goes wrong in people that are colour blind. So firstly, the way that we can perceive the many, many different colours that we can uh, is because of the, these photosensitive pigments that are found in the cones in our retina. And we have three pigments that are found in three different cones. And these pigments are sensitive in the blue, green, and red wavelengths. And what we do, depending on how much this uh, photosensitive pigment has been stimulated or how much this cone has been stimulated, uh, we then use a blending technique of these three colors uh, to get all the colors that are in between these three colors. Uh, and we can then see thousands of different colors that we can work out. If for some reason one of these cones isn't producing the correct photosensitive pigment, uh, we say that we are colorblind and we lose the ability to distinguish between particular colors. And there are multiple different types of colorblindness uh, depending on which uh, cones aren't working correctly and the way in which they're not working correctly. The most common form of color blindness is red-green color blindness. And this affects about 8% of males and 0.5% of females. This is generally a hereditary disease and uh, is sex-linked, which is why it occurs in males far more than it occurs in females. And people with red-green color blindness lack the photosensitive pigment that is, picks up either red or green light. So they are unable to distinguish between red and green. So here in this picture, you can see a, uh, there are red and green apples. So on the top is uh, what a normal uh, vision person or normal color vision person would see and being able to fairly easily distinguish between the red apples and the green apples. Uh, the bottom half of this is a, what a colorblind person would see. They would see, so if this, in this case, this is the uh, photo pigment that picks up red is not working. So they'll see all of these apples as some shade of green. This can be hard, uh, especially when driving, uh, when you're trying to pick up the difference between red and green traffic lights. In this video, we've talked about color vision being vision that comes from three different types of cones with photosensitive pigments in them, uh, in the red, blue, and green. We've talked about color blindness being the condition where you do not produce these pigments and therefore cannot distinguish between particular colors. And the most common type of color blindness being red, green color blindness. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.